It's time to face it. Our healthcare system is killing us. America's inability to address the healthcare crisis is literally taking years off our lives, off your life. Medical costs are the number one cause of bankruptcy in the US. 137 million Americans struggled to pay medical costs last year alone. Altogether, we went $88 billion in debt to pay for our care. 88 billion in one year. And look at how much each of us spends, more than any other developed country in the world. Think we get better care because we spend more? We don't. If you compare 100 Americans to 100 people from your average developed country, the Americans would lose 31% more years off of their life due to sickness and disability. Quote, exploiting loopholes or lobbying politicians is more profitable than improving efficiency or quality. End quote. Our government has been bought and sold. Big Pharma makes billions. Big Pharma made $31 billion of OxyContin alone. They use millions of it to hire lobbyists who propose new laws to politicians and deliver massive political donations on behalf of their client. Then the politicians pass the laws that help Big Pharma secure even bigger profits and the cycle continues. In 2017, some 300 former Congress members and staff were healthcare industry lobbyists, selling their political connections in exchange for laws that affect your health. Our broken health care is about more than Democrats or Republicans. It's about a corrupt political system. It's why the Affordable Care Act hasn't delivered everything it promised. It's why the Congress cut more than a third of preventative care funding. And it's why America's opioid crisis got out of control. I know this seems hopeless, so I found someone who could give us hope.